Roberts show this week. Obviously, I'm not Corey Roberts, and this is not KG. I'm Miss King Hanley. Nice to see you this week. We're going to start out talking about some of our Ram Pride winners. Um, we've got Chanel Vanilla, Jagger Ferguson, Hannah Hilton, James Stowers, Jonathan Fields, and Taylor Eskew. Congratulations to you students for being written up for good things. See Miss Foggy in the office to claim your prize. Now, Jimmy Ann, I've seen these green papers floating around, so what can you tell me about these green sheets? Um, those green sheets are for the seniors, and what you do is you fill it out, and you go to, or first you go to guidance in Miss Seals' office, and you pick it up, and you fill it out, and next week we will have four students talk about what they're taking their talents to next year, pretty much like college, what you want to major in, so make sure you pick one up in guidance and take it to room 310 for Miss Morris to get featured on the show. All right, so seniors, pay attention to that green sheet. You heard what Jimmy Ann had to say about that. Also, we know we're thinking about the prom coming up soon, so there are certain things that you do want to do and wear for the prom, and certain things you do not want to do and wear for the prom. So we're gonna talk a little bit about those and show you a clip later on having to do with the prom. So uh, have fun, but do the right thing. What else have we got today, Jimmy Ann? Um, yearbook applications for next year will be available um, today, actually. You just have to go by Miss Miss Worst Room in 310 and pick it up and fill it out and then give it back to her as soon as you can. We are looking for creative people, people who can write really well, take good pictures. So if that's something you're interested in, please pick up an application. Speaking of creative people, those of you who are interested in drama at Southwood next year, auditions are going to be held this Friday, March 20th at 2 p.m. at Southwood. So go do your thing, you creative people. Finally, this week, we're going to look at a clip from a movie that was very popular in my childhood, The Goonies. Ms. McGee's Film Studies and her students are picking an inspirational clip of the week. Mr. Roberts has asked them to do that. So I'm real excited to see this week's clip, and we're going to hear Drake Smith talk a little bit about it. Thank you, Westside. Go Rams! attention because this is a video for both of you. Um, I'm going to start with girls, of course, because there's a lot more that they can't wear rather than guys. So, guys, just keep paying attention because later at the end is when your part of the dress code is going to come along. Alright, girls, first off, alright, so we know prom season is coming up and everyone's starting to look for dresses here that, um, but here's a couple of things to keep in mind whenever you are looking for dresses and when you're purchasing your dresses. First off, it should not be too short at all. You know, like, what's too short. You know that about fingertip length is probably where we all need to be as far as dresses are concerned. Second off, it shouldn't be too tight at all. If you can't move in your dress during the night, it's not right. So try it again. Um, third off, I don't want to see any extreme cutouts. Being extreme moderate is fine. Um, just to make sure you check in with it, just to make sure that it is perfectly fine. Um, no cleavage. That's, of course, like, that's just common knowledge. Like, we don't deal with that at all. Um, let's see. And then two We all know they're getting really, really popular and they're really, really nice, but we don't want to see any extreme two pieces at all. Like, I don't want to see everything that 
you have. So let's just keep it fair game, no extra two pieces. Um, and lastly for the girls, we don't want to see anything that's too low cut in the front or in the back. So as far as the back is concerned, I know that it needs to at least stop where your jeans would normally stop for you. Um, low cut in the front, that's all. You shouldn't be able to tell that on your own. If you can't, you need to get someone to check out your dress. Um, and in my opinion, if you have to get someone to check it, then it's probably not the right kind of dress. So, moving on to the guys. Guys, you only have two things that you need to keep in mind. One, you need to wear a shirt under your vest whenever you show up to prom. There should not be guys all around in vests with no shirts under them. That is not going to be allowed this year. And two, that this is a formal event and that you need to wear slacks, not blue jeans or khakis. So with that being said, um, just keep all these tips in mind. And if you have any other questions about your wear, um, just ask Miss Jones about it and she'll be able to answer those questions for you. So good luck. I'm Drake Smith from Miss McGee's First Block Film Studies class. And I'm here to inter introduce the motivational clip of the week. It's from the Goonies and it's about how what we do now affects our future. Chester Copperpot, don't you guys see? Don't you realize? He was a pro. He never made it this far. Look how far we've come. We got a chance. Chance at what, Mikey? Getting killed? Look, if we keep going, someone's really going to get hurt. Maybe dead. Besides, we got to get to the police. Maybe Chunk already got to the police. Maybe Chunk is dead. Don't say that. Never say that. Goonies never say die. I'm not a goonie. I want to go home. I forgot. But still, don't you realize? The next time you see Sky, it'll be over another town. The next time you take a test, it'll be in some other school. Our parents, they want the best of stuff for us. But right now, they gotta do what's right for them. Cause it's their time. Their time. Up there. Down here, it's our time. It's our time down here. That's all over the second we ride up Troy's bucket. I will attack, and you don't want that!